start this off with hey y'all welcome back to my channel it's don't touch my afro but I have a name change you guys I have a name change I decided that and I had been like kind of like watching videos on it and then my girlfriend brought it up and I just decided like I do not want to be known as like don't touch my afro like, I love that I started off my YouTube channel with that name. If I become like super famous and my YouTube channel blows up and like I get like endorsement deals and stuff like that, I just don't want it to be under the name Don't Touch My Afro. If I get invited to a seminar to go speak tomorrow, I don't want to like greet everybody with like, Hey y'all, so I don't know if you guys ever watched my channel, but I'm Don't Touch My Afro. Like, I don't wanna be known as that because it's not me, that's not my name. I decided to change my YouTube channel's name to my name. So it now is Taylor Lynn. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Taylor Lynn. Today we're gonna jump right in and I am gonna be giving you the secret to my top five favorite face mask that I love to use and I do a face mask every Sunday it's like my like little self-care phones ringing in the background all right I do try to get a face mask and on other days besides Sunday that doesn't always happen and it's fun like you can have the greatest time of your life with face masks because you don't always just have to use one particular face mask you can use like if you if you have one that is supposed to like help with like impurities in your face and you have like a lot of marks on your cheeks you can use your green tea mask over here and then if you have some active breakout you know situation going on in the center of your forehead grab that face mask that helps for active breakouts and put that there like you don't have to use one specific face mask so let's get into it let me show you guys let me show you guys what i'm working with my earring keeps turning around and it's annoying, but I have these really cute earrings. I got them when I was in New York. Let me see if I can zoom in for you guys. Aren't they cute? Oh my gosh, they're like the cutest things. Focus. Focus. Can you focus on me? Next to me and they were a dollar at a store, I think it was like a beauty supply store in New York. Bomb, right? 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 Back up, because I'm scaring. I'm scaring myself. Too close for the people. Too close, too close for the people. We're good? We're good. So I have my top five face masks here. Well, I have my top Four, and I, I'm gonna have to insert an image of um, one of them when it, I talk about it because I don't have it physically with me. So the first one is, can you zoom in for me? A little blurry, but it's the Freeman. I love these masks so much like they're really cheap you can find these at five below you can find these at Ulta these ones might be like $4.99 at Ulta and probably like five dollars same price five dollars at both places this one is the cleansing apple cider vinegar clay mask plus scrub and oh my gosh I think the main reason why I love these is because they're always like two in one. Like you could choose to like literally wash your face with this or you could just choose like you could use, cause I think it has, yeah, inside of it, I got one with the crappy top that don't never wanna close. There we go. But yeah, this one has like little beads inside of it. So if you didn't wanna use it as a clay mask, you could just simply use it as like a exfoliator. Um, and you could probably do this like every other day to just like really exfoliate. And I picked this one up because it was, it had apple cider vinegar. And I wanted to get this because I, I always gravitate towards the mask that say instantly tones, purifies or like mattifies your skin because I feel like my skin is so oily. Like I just took the butter out of the refrigerator and just rubbed it on my face. 
sometimes like putting on a mask like the night before sometimes really does help my face to not get so oily throughout the day the next day if I decide that I want to wear makeup so if you guys were looking to purchase this I would definitely purchase it it's at five below and it's super cheap and affordable and I love it my next mask is the one that I don't have with me but um, it is the Indian clay face mask then you pair it with apple cider vinegar that one is probably my favorite out of the five because it is just very strong and I feel like it pulls out a lot of your impurities and I noticed that when I am using it faithfully my skin seems to be like very clear and like my breakouts are controlled and I don't have a lot of like discoloration in my face so not only is it a, a mask for your face but it's also a mask for your hair, like sis, pick it up. Um, I did order mine on Amazon and it was like $10 for like the smaller container of it. And I recently seen it at Target for like $7.99. Next up on my list is another Freeman mask and it is the Deep Clearing Manuka Honey and Tea Tree Oil Clay Mask and Cleanser. So it looks like this my camera is just being stupid and not zooming in so that you guys can see I love this because um for my hair my deep conditioner that I love to use is the Manuka honey with Marufa oil shea moisture deep conditioner and I love that conditioner for my hair so then when I was in Ulta one day and I seen that this had Manuka honey in it I was like I'm about to get this and it has tea tree oil in it and tea tree hot I can't talk today it's bad tea tree oil is like one of my favorite 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 things for my face I just recently went back to using tea tree oil as my toner for my face because a couple years ago I had broke out really bad around my mouth from eczema like it literally cleared my eczema and so why would you stop using it on your face and I'm seeing differences in my skin but I'm also one of those people who can use something new and then two days later be like oh my god it's a miracle it's clear yeah we not going are you stupid are you done this this is almost um gone this is actually also my second tube of this one this is for oily and breakout skin which is something that I have and I hate it and if you're not struggling with it, girl, <sighs> I'm jealous. My next mask is another Freeman mask. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Crazy, right? And I tell you that these masks, like I kid you not, like these masks are like my holy grail because they're so cheap and I feel like they're very effective. So it's not like they're cheap masks and you don't really see any like thing <laughs> like you, you don't notice any differences in your skin but you're like it's cheap I'm gonna use it self-care but these things are actually cheap and they actually work so I'm sticking to these Freeman masks like for real this next one is the avocado and oatmeal clay mask and this one is for normal slash combo skin it deep cleans and purifies pores this was actually the first mask that I got out of all of these and I realized how much I really loved um, Freeman's mask. I, however, don't reach for this one as often as I used to reach for it because I really love the deep clearing Manuka honey and tea tree oil one and I really love the um, cleansing apple cider vinegar one so I also find that I don't reach for this one as often as I used to reach for it when I first got it but it is a really good mask and it is one it was one of my favorites and it still is one of my favorites I just happen to use those ones a little bit more but next up is this formula 10.06 and it's pores be pure skin clarifying mud mask it's strawberry and yarrow I don't even know how to pronounce that but I also really like this mask as well. I like this brand of mask. And this is another clay mask. And as you can see, that is a theme amongst all of my masks. I really love clay masks. I feel like they just really like tighten my face when they dry. 
and they just like kind of brighten my face like every mask that I have when I take it off my face is a little bit brighter and I feel like it really does what it says it's really toning my skin this skin refining mask with berry boosters goes straight to work on clogged pores strawberry and rosemary eliminate impurities while euro clarifies skin for instant complexion perfection it smells oh my god <sighs> It smells so good, it literally smells like strawberries. Like I literally just pour strawberries out of the refrigerator and just like crushed them and put them into this and made my own like little face mask. And out of the five, I probably reach for these ones the most. These are the face masks that like I put on and I reach for like the utmost out of all of these. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. These are just some little, um, are just like, I don't know, little secrets on the face masks I like to use on my face for self care. And it's really nice because these masks are also, um, you know, they're, they're dual. So you can like cleanse with them or you could do like a facial scrub or use it as a mask. You could get multiple use out of them while still being cheap and not breaking the bank sis. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And if you guys pick these masks up, Please let me know how you like them and if you don't pick them up, sis, what are you doing? Pick them up, okay? Let's have a self-care day together. This video also, by the way, is not sponsored. Freeman sponsor me, but it's not sponsored. I just really enjoy these masks and of course, obviously, I ended up using majority of these, which I didn't even realize it like before I went to go film this video. I was like, dang girl, like how many Freeman masks you gonna have? But <laughs> Baby girl, make them cheap enough and I will have them all, okay? So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you all in my next one. Bye! Y'all, turn back wheel!